Jeds, just uh, remain standing for a couple minutes. <laughs> You may look back on it and go, what the hell have I done? You know, how did I do this? Or how did I get here? Uh, but every one of us is a volunteer. And every one of us understands, at the end of the day, why we're different. Why we are called Marines. We've had an opportunity in the last, took came the Commandant of the 20 them about what it means to be a United States Marine. So, for us, to be able to come from Paris Island and San Diego, where the transformation began, and to see how the transformation is carried all the way out here means a lot to us. We, uh, I came here with a, I've got a couple of messages to deliver. You know, we left, uh, work. Now, I don't get phone calls every night from the President of the United States, okay? I don't want you, I'm not trying to say, maybe you can't argue with me, Christmas in Afghanistan, and I'm like, and he got quiet on the other end of the phone. And then he said, uh, he's been over here. I had an opportunity this summer to tell him how much I thought of the Marines, and how much I love being a Marine. Uh, so he understands. He says, Merry Christmas and thank you for doing what you're doing. Thank you for your sacrifice. It's a great time to be a Marine. Uh, I tell you what, I've had people that you know, they lament as to every week. And uh, you see your brothers. Those of you that, uh, those of you that have lost your your brothers, uh, and then those in the Marine Corps, when you stay in, you're going to look back and say, you know, I was part of that return margin. When everybody else said during the summer, well, maybe it's too hard. Maybe it can't be done. You're going to say, no. When was the last time anybody said anything about margin? When was the last time? Don't be on the yellow footprints learning about what you did as margin. And that is a fact, because you